Dear Elena and Elijah, a rich man will change a broke woman's life. But a broke woman, or excuse me, a rich woman won't even look a broke man's way. Uh, so again, this is Operation Fatherhood YouTube channel. If you would, please like, subscribe, and share, and leave a comment. And let's continue to work to uh, build up our fathers everywhere and build up the next generation. So dear Elena and Elijah and my fellow fathers, um, Rich Cooper, I was just listening to a little while, little while ago, and he had a really good quote. I just He just kind of knocked me out where he said, a rich man uh, will... Uh, change a broke woman's life, but a broke woman, oh, excuse me, I keep saying a, a rich man will change a broke woman's life, but a rich woman won't even look a broke man's way. And that struck me because, you know, as a reminder to me and what he's getting at in the video is that how men and women are very different. Now, let me also uh, throw in that I don't think Rich Co Cooper is a, a believer. Like I'm a religious uh, Christian. I'm a Christian. I'm very religious. Um, so, his view on things and many others that are kind of in that uh, sphere of what he does, Kevin, Samuel, Kevin Samuels and others. Uh, obviously, you know, I and they may not agree on everything, but I think their their opinions as far as the differences between women and when we date each other, get married, things of that nature are really important and really should be considered. So that's why it's always important, you know, especially for me as a father, you know, to make sure I raise up both my children in what I believe is the way of the Lord uh, as a Christian, but at the same time, give them, you know, that bit of reality where um, although um, sometimes people get married and, you know, say, OK, well, we want to make sure we have a godly household, Christian household, whatever. But being honest, uh, I also have to remember and, I, you know, I want to tell my children the same thing is that in many cases um, and what Rich Cooper was pointing out, and I think he has some good factual evidence for it, is that men will look at women as this, and this is what he said. I'm going to put the, the video in the, in the show description as well. Um, he said men will look at women as a beauty object or a sex object, right? Um, which I kind of hate, despise the word object, but let's, you know, we'll just say it for now. Um, women will look at a man as a success object. And like I said before, that was, you know, the, after my divorce, that was more of a reality for me. Not that, you know, to say my ex is like, a you know, some money hungry, you know, evil person. I'm not, you know, saying all that, all of that. Um, but the importance of having, you know, having funds and, and not only that, but really being a, a success uh, financially, you know, physically, uh, mentally, you know, things of that nature, having a home, certain cars to drive and stuff like that. Um, and if you are the kind of person that thinks, oh, OK, well, I don't want to marry that kind of you know, female. Or I don't want to marry that kind of male. Then you might need to look out for certain red flags. You know, uh, maybe she didn't see certain red flags with me, you know, where um, in, the, in the beginning, maybe I didn't see certain red flags with her. But it's one of those things where I think is it is very, very important that we hold on to that men and women are different. You know, that the, the times we live in now, you know, there are more and more women um just, you know, and I agree with it to some degree, you know, a career uh, oriented, you know, they want to be able to make, you know, as much money as, as men. And, and in previous decades, they've been kind of held down to not be able to do that. You're just supposed to be married, uh, go have babies and that kind of that kind of thing. Um, but at the same time, you know, there are certain things that if they do, you know, marry a man, then they're looking for certain things. The same thing with a, with a man, they're looking for certain things. And so, so that's kind of the thing I think that was just very, very uh, just a key you know, um, as far as my mindset now, you know, after my divorce and the um, the the importance of really, you know, thinking about and realizing, hey, when I, you know, uh, if if God opens that door for me to get married again, I got to be on my P's and Q's and think more in terms of financial success, wealth, growing uh, wealth, being able to, you know, be a blessing to my children financially um, because, you know, in reality, women do look for that. They they may not say that they're money hungry or it's not important in the beginning. But if as a man, if you stay in that lane of, OK, well, I'm not going to you know really worry about the money aspect or, or uh, go and try to beat down the door to be the biggest you know salesman ever or be the biggest whatever financially. But, you know, that that really might hurt you in the long run uh, because marriage is in, you know, unfortunately, so many marriages end in divorce, 50 50 shot. And a lot of it is uh, based on finances. You know, 
oddly enough, I remember even Rich Cooper pointed this out and others have said it to me too, that in the last few decades, uh, I think it's up to like 70 to 80 percent of all marriages are, are ended in the, the end of divorce are is initiated by women. Now, as far as statistically from what I've seen, I don't know if they've given the specifics on why those women chose that route. However, it is something that we have to consider. Um, so, again, men and women are very different. Right. And also making sure we hold on to and remember that who we marry and really checking to be sure that the person that you marry is what you um, want to be in the long run or who you want to be with in the long run. Right. So even though she says that money is no big deal or he says that, you know, your looks aren't no big deal. <sighs> might want to really, really rethink that. Right. So a rich man will change a broke woman's life. A broke woman won't even look a, a rich woman won't even look a broke man's direction. Something to think about.